Hey there, fellow educators. Today we're diving into the world of record keeping in the teaching sector. First up, the Data Protection Act 2018 and GDPR. These regulations ensure that personal data from learners to staff is treated with care. We're talking about the content, data accuracy, and respecting privacy rights. The benefits enhance privacy rights and responsibility when it comes to data handling. But hey, compliance can be a bit tricky and resource intensive. So it's all about finding that right balance. Next on the list, Ofsted. They have a specific framework requiring us to keep records about teaching, learning, student progress, and more. It's all about accountability and quality education. The pros, well, it keeps us accountable, helps with self-assessment and supports the improvement planning. But be aware of the paperwork overload. We still want time for actual teaching, right? Now safeguarding procedures. We're legally obligated to keep records of child protection and safety concerns. So it's all about maintaining a safe environment for our learners. The upside ensures that we take the right steps to protect our learners and provides an audit trail for investigations. But remember, confidentiality is the key here. Lastly, your IEPs. And these are your individual education plans with learners with special needs. These plans are crucial for personalized support, communications and tracking progress. Ensure all staff members are on the same page can be a challenge. The benefits. Well, they have us provide the right support and track its effectiveness. But yes, creating and updating them for each student requires time and effort. So there you have it from data protection to Ofsted, safeguarding and IEPs. Record keeping is the backbone of our education system. So let's find that perfect balance between paperwork and quality teaching.